Warehouse employees of the Wegman supermarket chain are getting used to a quicker, more eco-friendly way to do their jobs. Our Eva Master Matteo visited the produce facility in Pottsville to see the change taking place on the ground floor. And she has more in tonight's PA Green Report. Scheip glides through the produce warehouse on her new wheels at work. She heads to the so-called filling station with her pallet jack. It takes her up to two minutes to load the tank with hydrogen fuel before it's back on the produce floor of the Wegmans warehouse. The jacks are a lot easier to maneuver. They're not as hard in steering um, because of the, the light weight and not having the battery on. This is a look at the old charger and the old battery. This only went up to about eight hours for use. And now with the new technology, the pallet jack will last up to 12 hours. A battery loses power during the shift, so you start off at 24 volts, it slowly drops down and the trucks go slower. Um, in the case of the fuel cell, as long as there's fuel in it, it always maintains the same power output. Wegmans unveiled 50 new pallets. They received $1 million from the Pennsylvania Energy Development Authority to offset the cost for the infrastructure, including an on-site hydrogen tank. Wegmans had to pay out more than a million of its own money. Savings, though, are expected to come back to the company in time. We're always looking for ways to um, you know, increase our sustainability efforts and do what we can to help the environment. This project isn't enough to change prices in Wegman stores. Damascal, however, says the productivity will increase in order to better service the locations. With your PA Green Report, Eva Master Matteo, Eyewitness News. The new equipment is expected to be used for at least the next six years. Now, in March, nine hydrogen fuel cell-powered forklifts will be added to the fleet at that warehouse in Pottsville. It services 30 Wegman stores in the locations in our...